Historically, the number one cause of migrant deaths have been due to drowning in canals, but this year was different. Agents at our southern border say they conducted more than 490 rescues and saw 149 deaths. Of those, 60 were heat related. One Border Patrol agent tells us when smugglers house migrants, they typically have very little food and water. Then once smugglers decide to try and illegally cross migrants, they fall victims to the heat. That's why we're trying to be proactive and we're putting signs up about the dangers, uh, trying to educate migrants about the dangers. Right now, our message is please do not expose to the extreme cold that is up, that's nearing here in January in the borderland. El Paso Border Patrol agents have been using signs like these for migrants to call 911 and be able to give first responders a precise location of where they are. Now, when it comes to overall encounters at the New Mexico border, there has been an increase since 2022. 2022 had more than 143,000 migrant encounters. 2023 had more than 170,000 encounters. And the 2024 fiscal year has already had more than 16,000 in its two months in the studio. Stephanie Muniz, KOAT Action 7 News. Stephanie, thank you. During the 2023 fiscal year, there were more than 2.4 migrant encounters nationwide.